Well, big eyes, full lips, high cheekbones, you can fake it with makeup. And here with the tricks, under five bucks, is Shell Dunaway, creative director of Elf Cosmetics. Welcome. Thank I love you. this because you can get a good deal. Hey, that's what we're all about. <laughs> I know. Let's get right to it. Let's First of all, let's talk a little bit about the eyes. We have uh, Carolyn here that's mm -hmm. going to help us out. Tell me where you start. Okay, what you want to do is you want to start off with just kind of a, a basic brown just to kind of add to the eyes. Okay. You just want to dust it on the lids. This will kind of just contour and create that depth that you're looking for. All right, and this is to make them a little bit bigger. So that's a neutral eyeshadow. Now next you line it with a pencil. So what's the yes. trick with the liner? The liner, what you want to do is get as close to the lash line as possible. Okay. So you just right there and just kind of trace along the lash line and a good tip to use is to go ahead and with your ring finger smudge in at the corners to get mm -hmm. more of a dramatic smoky look. Oh, okay. I was wondering yeah. how you get the smoky part. All right, you curl and then you apply the mascara in that order, right? Very important okay. to remember. And so what you want to do is just take your curler and just curl your lashes right there mm -hmm. and press down gently. Okay, and then you put the mascara on. You don't do it then the other way. you put way. the mascara I on. always wonder about that. And then finally, false lashes. Those are so popular nowadays, right? False lashes are my favorite mm -hmm. because they really pop in the camera. Just add a couple little tiny false lashes. Okay. Um, they're individuals. Just put them where you want. I usually try and focus more on the outer corners. Cut them for little tiny ones to fill in any sparse areas. All right, and then the total for this trick? Only $5. I love it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that is a sound to my ears. All right, let's move on. Next, we've got lips, and we've got Sherry here to help us out. What are some tricks you made to uh, get her lips looking fuller? Well, lips are fantastic. What you want to do is I went ahead and used our lip definer and shaper. Use the lighter pearl side okay. and go right in the cupid's bow area, that little V part of the lip, to make it pop. And then line the lips with the shaper side okay. right here, and that will really define it. All right, now after the lip is shaped, what do you want, what do you need to apply? Something else? Yeah, what you want to do, balm? especially for the winter time, is mm -hmm. apply some balm. This okay. will just help you get a real nourished look on the lips, All right. so there's no flaking. Keep them healthy and not dry and nasty. All exactly. right. Exactly. Um, then finally, you add uh, gloss. Is that right? What does that do? Well, you want to use a plumper, which is fantastic okay. to really give you that vava vum look. Mm -hmm. And we went ahead and used the clear all over to not mess up the color. Got it. And then a nice little trip, a little tip to use is use the clear little pearl side right there in the middle of the lip. This oh. will really have the light reflect on it. Gosh, you know how to do it all. I like that. Thanks. I like the double sided Yeah, it's this. great. All right, total price for this one. Let's hear it. Five dollars. Okay, <laughs> I can take that. Finally, the face. Um, here we've got Pamela. We've, we're creating the high cheekbones. Yes. Which uh, always are lovely. Where do we start? What we want to do is go ahead and use a powder and just blend all over the face. This okay. will give you a nice matte, you know, finish and just even out the skin tone. All right, and then what do we go next after the matte powder? What you want to do is use a bronzer. This is my favorite product. Just go ahead and blend all around the hairline, mm -hmm. down along the jawline. This will really help define the features. And you really want to focus right on the hollows of the cheek. This will give you that definition. All right, it's good, especially for the winter time. And exactly. then finally, uh, we need to put the blush on there, right? So you yes. contour first and then contour you do the blush? First. Yes, and for the blushes, you want to draw on the apples of the cheeks. And a great little tip to find the apples of the cheeks is to smile. And this cute little part of the cheek, you just want to go ahead and blend the color right on there. Oh, looks great. I love it. Total price for this one? Believe it or not, $5. Oh, I love this. <laughs> all right, music to our ears. Michelle, thanks so much for Thank coming you. in. And of course, all these products, these are all Elf Cosmetics. Yes. For more of Michelle's makeup tips, tips log on to WPIX.com slash morning.